My name is Odir Campbell. I am a forensic crime scene investigator. These are some of the equipments that we would use while on the crime scene. Um, different crime scenes require the use of different type of um, materials, right? So, you know, basically we'd use gloves to protect our hands. Right? We'd use cotton tip applicators to collect um, whatever substances are found which may be of evidential value. We would use different types of powders, black, white, fluorescent to detect, um, to develop um, fingerprints not visible to the naked eye. We'd use these brushes to apply the said powders, right? Different, different powders require the use of different brushes, right? Um, we would use chemicals to develop fingerprints as well, as well as chemical to chemicals to identify um, blood cleanup or to identify blood where it is. Right? We would use ink pads to record fingerprints of um, victims and accused if necessary. Right? We'd use these to clean up the ink off the fingers. Right? We would use um, these to sterilize our equipment after they are used on the crime scene. As well as we would use some of um, things like these to recover the fingerprints once they are developed using the various different powders. Right? Um, we would have to apply um, use of measuring devices, right, um, and scales as well too, to document whatever is found on the crime scene, for it to be recreated if necessary. What's the most shocking discovery you have ever made, or you have made since the three years you've been here? Mm. The most shocking thing I would have ever seen. Yeah. I, I swear, it's very hard to see. It's very hard to say. I can't think of anything off the top of my head right now. I guess maybe I am quite used to a lot of things. So, no. it's, so it's no longer shocking to me. There are a lot of weird things that I would have encountered. Okay. But in terms of maintaining the, the dignities of the victim, I wouldn't feel comfortable saying those things oh. over the media. That's the job taught me. Yeah. Um, being here, not to give up um, accuracy for speed. Um, work with the method, maintain the method because the method is what you will have to give account for. Okay. You know? The actions have to be uh, proportionate to what we are doing. So therefore, everything has to be justified as to why this function or this process was carried out. Mm -hmm. But everything that we do will be, may be submitted to the court for evidence. And if so, we will be asked to give testimony to the court on what was done and why it was done. The fact that every crime scene is individual, so it's like suiting up, it's like fitting a puzzle piece of a puzzle together mm -hmm. to tell a true story. So in terms of that, that is why I believe that I was uh, fit for the job. And the scientific process was what attracted me to it. So in terms of applying the scientific knowledge gained through training to carry out the, the various methodical processes, mm -hmm. I adapted to that very quickly and easily.